Hi there. I'd like to welcome you to World Literature 2. I am Dr. Sandra Sikowski and I will be your instructor. This is a survey course of the great works of literature from around the globe published from the 1700s up to the present day. We will journey around the world through literature and read some sample works from a wide variety of authors from a wide array of different cultures around the globe. We will also look at different forms of literature, different genres. We will look at the lyric poem, we'll look at the short story, we'll look at a play, and oral folklore. We have an exciting journey ahead of us, so let's get started. The first thing you must do is get a textbook. We will be using the Norton Anthology of World Literature, Volume 2, the shorter fourth edition. Everyone must have a copy of the textbook. You will find PDFs of the first modules reading, but after that, everything is going to come from this textbook, except for a couple texts near the end. Um, so the textbook is the first priority. Make sure you get a textbook. Next, read the syllabus. Read through the whole syllabus so that you'll understand how you'll be graded. You'll understand my expectations about from you. Um, and then after you read the syllabus, take the syllabus quiz. This is required. Next, go to the introductions discussion board forum and post something about yourself. Make sure you answer all the questions posted so we can get to know you better. You can find a link to that discussion board forum at the very top of module number one. Then, once you do that, you're ready to begin working through the modules. First, read the overview of the module. Then, read the selection in our textbook or do the reading that is posted in a PDF document online. Then, read the instructor's material for each text. Next, you're ready to answer the questions on the discussion board. Remember that this is worth 20% of the final grade, so make sure you complete all of the questions. Look under grading rubrics to see how I'll grade your discussion board activity. Once you complete all the questions on the discussion board, then take the module quiz or complete the module assignment. For two of the modules, we'll be writing an essay instead of taking a quiz. We have two essays this semester and a quiz for almost every module, along with a midterm and a final exam. So first thing to do is get a textbook, then read the syllabus, then complete the introductions discussion board post, and then you're ready to start working on the modules. Make sure you look at the course schedule for a detailed list of assignments and due dates. The course calendar contains all the due dates for assignments, quizzes, and tests, but not the discussion board activities. Those due dates are in the course schedule. I will be posting videos to introduce each module, so keep an eye on the announcements for those instructional videos. And I look forward to getting to know all of you and to sharing these fascinating texts with you. Let's get started.